Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning in here on Raw Stat Reviews. Today, as you can see, it's for comparison of the OG Superman statue and recover one half scale by Prime One Studio and the new black suit Superman by Prime One. So, this new black suit here was announced approximately a year ago, something like that. And um, back then the Snyder Cut has not been um, confirmed. So that Prime 1 took some liberties here with that suit design. So they didn't base it um, completely on the Man of Steel black suit that we have already seen um, in the movie. And they didn't know exactly probably how the black suit in the new Justice League Snyder Cut will look like. So they just um, used the BBS suit here and basically repainted it black. The S symbol looks, however, um, very similar to the one that we have seen in Man of Steel. Fortunately, the belt is not painted silver, which would have been a cool further highlight. But you can see that the head sculpt has been um, repainted and probably they also used another material here for the hat. The sculpt is completely the same. I've checked both hats for quite some time and um, pretty sure that the sculpt is exactly similar. But the paint and probably the material used, not that much of a translucent resin, give it a completely different look. For me, it's a slight upgrade, I would say, to the original version, which due to the translucency, looks a bit yeah, action figure-like, um, if you will, so a bit plasticky. Um, the other one looks more realistic and has more details. It is a bit pale on the other side, especially compared here to the OG version, which um, due to the translucent resin used and the uh, skin color that they chose here looks a bit more healthy, let's say. Um, so I think I can keep this rather short. Uh, you can see that they both have the same, um, the exact same base. Um, what I can highlight here is um, well, the cape is made of the exact same material, very, very thick nice fabric um, the black one looks super cool as well has some kind of uh, little silver sparkles um, in it looks really really good what is different is um, the material that they used here for these applications here on the suit so these here they are glued to the body so you cannot move them and they are a bit thicker here as you can see they look fantastic. Really like the highlights here on the wrists and the belt. Um, so here they used another material which is not that thick. It's still something that is... Um, it's, it's rubber parts that are um, somehow glued over the suit, I believe. Maybe they worked into the suit more than the other ones here from the OG. Um, but they are movable, so they are... Um, basically yeah, glued only on the suit and not on the body as is the case here so here you, they are unmovable you just can move the parts here between these um, applications um, I've already shown you my um, original suit in a separate video as you can see the problem here was that the S symbol was um, positioned rather far down um, so they are so mine isn't that bad you can see that from these little applications here they you have approximately five or so between the um, upper part of the S symbol and the neck area and here they positioned it right um, so here the 
space between the S symbol and the neck is much less than with the other suit. Um, I think both look really good, so um, I do not complain that much here with the original suit. I think um, the position of DS is really not a deal breaker for me at least. Um, so now you have to decide which head sculpt you like more. Um, as I said, I like both a lot. So this one looks um, focus in there. This one has a really very healthy and nice look to it. Um, they use this translucent resin there, um, which is, in my opinion, pretty great. Um, but it looks a little bit unnatural, maybe. Um, looks very, very good, though. So, really like the side views. Um, this one here. Um, it's really very good as well. You can see that the eyes are painted a bit more detailed, so you see more of the eyelashes here with that one. And you also see a little bit more details. Um, for example, the eyebrows are thinner here than on this version, as you can see. Um, also the hair here. Um, it's a bit less pronounced than on the black version, as you can see here. Mm. And you see a little bit more details here on, on that one than here on this. Um, so it's a bit more washed out here, maybe on this version, than on the other one. Um, yeah, still on both have the same sculpt, so it's really amazing to see how a different um, statue can look just due to paint and material used. Um, I think both of these statues are really absolute highlights in the collection, so if you own either of them, you can be already very happy, and if you own both, then you're a lucky bastard just like me. <laughs> um, so <laughs> really happy to have both of these here in my collection and very glad I could show you the comparison here. Um, I think I would never sell these statues. I'm getting the armored Batman in um, probably within the next weeks. Can't wait for the review of that one. Um, for we got the Nightmare version of Batman and we've also got Wonder Woman, as you know. You can check out the reviews of them um, on my channel. Um, let's give you a quick 360 here of both of them. Really like the black cape. Um, this black suit just looks badass and I think the new head sculpt. Um, it's really turned out great. The original suit, I mean this is of course Superman as we all know and love him. Love the blue and red colors of course of the original suit version and this movie suit is killer in my view. Looks really really good. All the costumes um, of the Jack Snyder DCU are just amazing. So I'm so happy that we will see the Snyder Cut and I am pretty sure if it's a hit then we will see more of the DCU in the future. That would be a dream coming true. So thanks a lot for watching guys. Um, as always, I appreciate it very much. Um, please leave your comments down below. Which version do you like more or do you like both equally? What do you think about the head sculpts and the overall appearance here of these two guys? Um, let's get you a quick view from below. Just amazing pieces. Really, 
really good. All right, please um, hit the like button and the subscribe button. And of course, if you want to take it a step further, then also hit the notification bell to not miss out on any new videos being uploaded here very soon on this channel. Thanks for tuning in and see you soon. Bye bye.